Evening's greetings, everyone. Today we're going to be playing some Risk of Rain 2. Um, because it's the next game in my cycle. I, I don't know what to say. Let's, let's get started, though. Alright, so we have a few characters now. I believe I played multi last time. Uh, who haven't I played? Rail Gunner, I think. So... I've clearly played Rail Gunner. Okay, well, I don't know who I played. Let's just play... Let's just play Rail Gunner. I feel like playing Rail Gunner. And maybe we can get Marksman. Hopefully. I think we're good with Rainstorm. I'm, I've been playing a little bit recently, but I want to build up my skill a little bit more before I jump into Monsoon. I'm not quite ready for that. And I still want my videos to be interesting. That's one. If we can get 30, then we're good. That's one. <laughs> Great. Ooh. Oh, crap. Oh, that's fine. The movement on... Oh, great. This is gonna suck. The movement on, um... Rail Gunner is really weird. Like, the movement ability. That's three. Uh, four. Five. Hey, you know, maybe we'll get this. That'd be nice. Oh, Chris. Not really, but I don't like it. Oh, great. I missed. One. Two. This whole video is going to be me counting. No, I'm kidding. Okay. You know what? I need a little bit of a way up. Ooh. Yes! Oh, I'm going to die. I'm gonna be sad if I die this early. I never play Railgunner, man. What are your guys' means in this game? I, uh... My main changes a lot. I like all the characters, except for maybe, like, Engineer. But, hey. I don't know. I'm just not the kind of person who can play engineer at all. Like, I respect people who can. Seems like a difficult character to play, but no thank you, personally. Oh, hey, you're here. I just snipe them from really far away. This makes the challenge way easier. Jeez, okay, I missed that one, but what the hell? All you guys should back off. Yeah, I'm gonna die if I don't get healing. I should probably go for items rather than just sit here and attack things randomly, but whatever. I don't play Railgunner much, but this seems like it'd be amazing. Wow. You know, it's really... I would honestly rather miss my shots than just get a normal scope. It's just so disappointing when it happens. It's like, that could have been a great shot. But you barely missed. Ooh, another crowbar. Hell yeah. Yo, I always forget how much I love this game. But it's honestly just amazing. Also, Gubo. Everyone's gotta love Gubo. It's an amazing item. <laughs> I don't know. I like it, personally, but... I've heard hate for it. I've heard a lot of hate for it. And very few good things. And it upsets me. Because it's like one of my favorite actives. Uh, probably. At least partially. Just because it's funny. To have a jelly version of you run around and kill things. Speaking of. I mean hey. Look at that. 2000 damage. I think they copy your items too. Which is always a plus. Right? I'm learning how to shoot things well. Oh, there's chests over there. Yeah, I'm gonna look around a little bit. Because I have some leftover money, might as well spend it. Monster Tooth. I will probably change that. 
I almost said shark tooth necklace. Anybody, um... Anybody like Terraria? I could do a Terraria series at some point, now I think about it, but... I probably want to finish off... I don't know. If I am going to do a Spore series, then I probably want to finish that off first, just because... Oh, also Focus Crystal. Gross. I'm playing Railgunner. But, um... You know, maybe we could do a quick Terraria series. It's a fun game. I like it, at least. I'm sure a lot of people watching could like it, too, because it's a pretty popular game. And, you know, it's like a win-win. Everyone wins, except for... I don't know. Probably someone. <laughs> I just think it's hilarious. Just be like, oh yeah, everyone wins. Except for probably someone. Even though I'm trying to defend my point that everyone wins. Very good rhetoric. I know. Thank you. I act like I'm talking to a live chat. I'm not. In case if anyone's wondering, in case if anyone wasn't around whenever I was trying to do inscription streams, the streaming doesn't work for me. Which is why I stopped the inscription series. But hey, that was a great game. It's just unfortunate that um, streaming wasn't working for me. But hey, still going with videos and that is nice. Personally, I prefer the, um, oh, great, I missed. I prefer the alternate version of Railgunner's M2, which is the main reason why I want to change it. Because, hey, this is great, but I prefer just being able to shoot it a bunch of times. And I would demonstrate if it weren't to delete, like, the two or three streak I have right now. Because every single one matters. I might just have part of a video at some point just be trying to get this which honestly is kind of turn and is what is what this is kind of turning into great great and missed i felt that coming before it even happened all right let's just go i have like eight items i'm so bad at counting Three, six, seven, eleven i think launch me. Indeed. Alright. Let's see, so it's actually 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and I think it's 11. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, great. Let me just get Gubo. I mean, <laughs> you gotta love when that happens. See, this is why I like Gubo, because it's just especially on a character like Railgunner, you can just not worry about taking too much Dude, are you kidding me? You can just not worry about taking too much damage at once. Seriously? Okay, maybe it's not the best for the marksman challenge, but still, I like Gubo in general. Might as well get that two in a row, right? Oh, great. You wanna. Yo, I'm angry. <laughs> I'm starting to get very slightly annoyed. Hey, I'm actually making a lot of these now. Honestly, if I get good at this, I might start maining Railgunner. And I might change which uh, M2 I prefer. I almost said R2. I don't... Like, like a PlayStation controller. So I don't... I don't play on PlayStation. No, I, I grew up with Xbox, um, not PlayStation. So, but I've never had a problem going between controllers. I don't know. I just don't understand whenever people have so much trouble, like, using the other one's controller. Like, it's a little bit confusing maybe the first, second time, but it's really not that difficult after that in my experience. But I don't know. Maybe I just have a controller ambidextry. Now, you know, the really funny thing about this map is that, oh, and for new players, little character name drop, but it's probably fine. You know, Rex, right? It's, um, there's that one challenge where you have to 
kill a uh, sand boy, the clay boss thing. I don't remember what it's called. Clay Dune Strider. Um, by knocking off the edge of this map. And I've been trying to get that achievement just by playing random runs. But I keep not getting this stage, and if I actually fight that boss this time, I'm gonna be really angry. Because I've even just gotten it on the wrong, um, stage two, I think, anyway. Yeah, no, stage two. The new, uh, what was it, like, Aphelion Sanctuary or whatever, the... Um... Surviving the Void one. I... I don't know. It's one with the big, uh, monolith-looking things. Very nice map, but very annoying that I am not getting the Rex challenge because of that, partially. That was unfortunate. Like, I'm doing pretty well. Oh, great. I'm doing pretty well, like, half the time. I can get, like, seven in a row. I'm just cutting off. I've gotten this challenge on an another account. Or another profile, I guess. But... Oh, hey. Can Gubo sit there? Gubo can be on it. I don't think Gubo will stay. Gubo, go! Can I do that? Ah. I mean, can I do that? No. Well, maybe I could knock one of the pots onto it. I don't know, might as well get that out of the way, right? I don't think I've done that yet. And if not, then I'll just do it while I'm playing Engineer or something. It's really easy with Engineer. Which sucks, because I don't- I, I, you know, I suck at Engineer. It's just not my playstyle. Mostly because I hate the M1 so much. I know that Grenades is a pretty controversial- the Bouncing Grenades is a pretty controversial M1. Some people hate it, some people think it's amazing. I don't like it. It really, I hate it. Because it's a slow charge up. It doesn't seem to do a ton of damage. Oh, wow. But I get that Engineer is a really good character. But I just hate the M1. It feels so uncomfortable to use that I just never play the character at all. But anyway. Wow, really threaded the needle. And I missed that one, too. Hi, right, there's a button. I wonder if I could try to summon Gubo. Um, wisps are the easiest thing to kill. I wonder if I could try to summon Gubo on it whenever I have already defeated the teleporter boss. There's no more enemies, doesn't have much any reason to move around other than maybe just like static movement. That's weird, static. But, you know, like, um, just, it just moves whenever it doesn't have, any, have anything to do. I need to use my M1 more. I mean, I know that M2 is like a big thing about the character, but I don't have to use it every single time. I say as I use it to kill something, of course. I will say, being a new YouTuber is pretty interesting to me. Because you can definitely notice a lot of things, um, a lot of small differences in your videos. I don't know, it's probably the same for bigger YouTubers, but I've never been one, so I wouldn't know. I want this. What? Oh, it died. Yay, I have it. <laughs> I'm going to act like a really angry child. Be like, I want it, and then I just kill everything around me. As children do. Gimme. Okay, I have a lot of items I need to scrap. Like, bison. Ooh. 
bison steak, uh, focus crystal. Monster tooth is not bad, but I don't like it. And by that, I mean it's bad. No, it's okay, but it feels like it's just really not that good. I don't know. I could probably check up on the math of it again. I haven't seen it in a little bit. Alright, Gubo, are you ready? Can you... Alright, I'll just kill it. I mean, why not? Pro I almost said crossbars. Crossbar? Oh. Crossbars can be like the thing on the center of your screen. On consoles, I think. In certain games, like Minecraft. Which would just be Minecraft in general, not consoles specifically. Whatever. No, that'd be a crosshair. What's a crossbar? Okay, no, I'll just... Whatever. Um... And now I've forgotten what I was gonna say. And that was a normal shot. It doesn't help to have drones, because I'm in a rush to kill everything before they can. I need to take my time and aim. We. Oh, and also it wasn't the stupid... Play Dune Strider. It was the Beetle Queen, so that's nice. You know, I can probably just dream of that stage repeatedly. Uh, I hate these things so much. Wait. Ha. Uh, that's funny. Uh, no, 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 no. I'm M1 this. I'm pretty sure you can have kills if it's with different weapons for the marksman achievement, just as long as you don't miss an M2 shot. I worded that very poorly. I think you can get kills with the M1. Like, you can use other weapons and get kills with them. The main thing is just not actually missing a shot, a weak point shot with the M2. Is there no weak spot? That was weird. And now it's too close. Not even gonna risk losing an M2 on that one. Got it. Hey, that thing has a mask like Huntress. Anyway, I missed. Oh, Huntress might have like stolen it or something. I don't know. I would doubt it though, considering they're from like an organized team with equipment. Why wouldn't they just use the actual equipment? And I get, oh, delicate watch. I have mixed feelings about that. And I guess that the mask of the bull or whatever could be better, but. How would you know that? I mean, unless. Jeez, could you back off, man? You are supposed to be blind. How do you know where I am? at every single moment of my existence. Like, these things. Are you kidding? Ah! Hitting him with target. Oh! Got it. Yay! Alright. Trying some chance or interest. No, I want Kubo. Trying some chance are interesting. Because I usually don't have that good of luck with them. It's usually like probably a good third of the time I'll get stuff, which is fair. But I'm getting really good luck now. You know, sometimes it'll just jump up to like literally every single use for like three runs in a row. Because I don't think I've used a Shrine of Chance and lost this run. Uh, 
Ah, I don't want to risk it. I really want to get that marksman achievement done. Do we have macho yet? I can also go for macho. But I assume that I have it. I'm already losing track of which achievements I have and I don't have. I'm really not that far into the series. Oh no. Okay. I knew that was risky, but I really hate these things, and if they're fire, Billine, I just don't even want to try. Shuriken. Um, okay. I don't know how I'll feel using that on Railgunner, but sure, yeah. Yes! Hey, you know what? If it actually works for the M2... Oh yeah, because M2 changes the M1. Okay, yeah, you know what? I'm good with that. Let's just go to the next save. This one sucks. I also killed this thing. You can hear it. Oh, great. I knew it. I knew it would do that. I can't shoot that. I can't shoot it. I can't shoot it. Okay. Yes! <gasps> no! Man, I had a good streak going too. Okay. I'll take Leech Seed. That's not terrible. It's not gonna make it that far anyway. I've heard that it falls off a lot later on. But... The farthest I plan on going is the main, the, I don't know what to say, canonical final boss? I don't know. I mean, I guess they're hypothetically all canonical. Because this is an ecosystem kind of thing. Like the the main final ow. Alright, let's just use the M1. I don't want to. Actually, I wanna snipe a bunch of things. It's like rail gunner. Oh great. It died from burning. Yeah, okay, I think I'm gonna... I'm not gonna go too hard on the marksman challenge. Because I don't think I'm gonna get it. Whoa. Hello there. Hey, if you want me to just snipe you from higher up, then sure. But it's not gonna stop me from sniping you. I hate to burst your bubble, but actually I don't. I prefer to burst your bubble. Oh! Jeez, okay. <gasps> it's weak spots are its eyes. Guff is adorable. And now I have to kill it. Well, goodbye. I'm sure I hit a weak spot somewhere there. I don't think I actually did. I can't even tell what's going on. I'm just massacring these guffs. Anyway. I mean, hey, I'm getting tons of money. Guffs are great for money, man. Look at that. Hey. Where's that owl? Oh, it's coming from down there. Hi, a monster log. Guff. As I would have expected from that. I mean, if there's a monster log, it's probably Guff, because I just killed, like, 12 Guffs or something. Hi. Those things are easy things, too. Why don't we go ahead and get this legendary chest? I heard some people say it's not worth it, but, I mean, I have the money. And I always like a nice little interstellar desk plant. Why not? 
It'll definitely be nice. Okay. It'll definitely be nice for dealing with grouped enemies. Oh, hi. You guys suck. I like the music. Very nice. Though I have to say, that was not the best spot for the guitar to go into, I don't know, high something. For the guitar to, like, get more intense. High gear, that's what it is, to get more, you know, intense. Because it was a, an elite that I one-shot. No, I usually don't mind you guys, but it kind of sucks. Oh. And I missed, because I was, I was too risky. Yeah, let's get this. I don't like green items so much. Ah, uh, ring the bell. Speaking of... <laughs> oh, executive card. Yes. 100% yes. Speaking of, if you guys enjoy my content... Please do like and subscribe, because then you can see more of it. I mean, it's 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 just it's just YouTube, how it works. I don't I, I don't know what else to say. It's just how that works. If you subscribe to me, then you'll see more of my content. Especially if you do ring the bell. Listen, I don't make the rules. I just advertise myself through them. So I I profit off them. Or I, I would if I were making money. Which I'm not. But I will profit off of them in the future. When I do start making money. Collect hey, you know what? I'll take it. I don't know why. I mean I assume a missile drone killed something, but it's just funny that I got that in a moment where I wasn't actually attacking anything. Also, you gotta love that, um, ignition tank. I have two gasoline thingies, gasoline canisters. Just, okay, I have two gasolines. I have two units of gasoline. And, um, you know, that's it, just so you know. But, uh, you know, I can get the, um, extra damage from it. What is that, like, weird red thing that's on, or, like, around Railgunner's head and, like, in front of her? Oh, hi. Because I just don't, I, I see that every single time I play Railgunner. Like, the red blobby thing. Oh, Gubo. I don't, I don't really care. I don't feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> ring the bell or <laughs> ring the bell or the bell will ring you take that as you will this is your final warning <laughs> oh hey hold on hold on line line up for a triple kill gotta love it See? yeah hey back off Man, this game's great, and I have no idea where to go. I assume I have to go back here. This is why I'm going up. Well, I don't have no idea, but I don't think the door's open on this generation. Which sucks. Oh, hey, it's the... Hey, what's that? Is that another missile drone? I'd love... Oh, you know, I'll take that. Hey, what's this? Charged perforator. Okay, I don't even remember what that does. I don't know if I've ever gotten that before. But, sure. Uh, Gore's Tomb actually could be nice. Anyway, talking about, um, what I said before, how did you guys feel about a Terraria series? Uh, you know, it could be a gameplay series, it could be really whatever. Uh, although I'm not gonna do expert or master mode, I could do normal. 
plastic. Not, I mean, I could, I could do turning it. Rather not, I think that'd be boring because I'd just get one really good item and then continue copying it because it's journey mode. I forgot that I saw this earlier. Anyway. Oh, okay. Magma worm. Well. This is gonna suck. Alright. I'm just shooting. I'm not even gonna try to find a weak spot. I... Even if I could... Or even if I... Could locate... I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm panicking. <laughs> even if I could know where it is, I wouldn't be able to keep track of it. I, I wouldn't be able to see it. It's so much... Oh, hey! Going fast recommended. That's funny. Because, you know, the game encourages you to go quickly. Ha ha ha. Anyway. Oh, this isn't too bad. I mean, I can't get any weak shots, because why? But, that's fine. I've rung so many bells. <laughs> Some point, like 50 episodes in this series or something, whenever I'm like, probably a good 70% of the way cleared through the game, I'm just gonna start saying that every time I kill a brass contraption for the first time. I'm gonna say, hey, you know, guys, you should really ring that bell. Or I might start doing it now. I usually only, I, I usually only say, um, to subscribe and like at the end of the video. But, hey, I mean, it would be useful to say it in the middle, too. Primordial teleporter aligns with the moon, and finally, we're gonna be able to go there and then die. What the hell is that plant doing there? Okay, sure. Whatever. Love it. I love it. Now, take fall damage again. And then have to wait to get my item. Can you not kill me? Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty much giving up on marksman now. Okay, just give me an item. Come on. You should die. Encrusted key is nice. I'm stressing out now. Alright, let's keep moving. We can, uh, maybe beat the game. That's the hope. Oh, hey. Idiot. Oh, hey. Idiot. Ring the bell. Okay, I'll stop. We. Oh, hey, there's a teleporter. Now let's mark that. You found Primordial Teleporter. Has been. What? Why is it not showing my name? I think it's done that before. Maybe it just does that when I'm recording? Maybe it can detect if I'm recording. I don't know. I don't know what games can and can't do, and. I mean, I know things like Discord can tell if you're recording, or just using OBS in general, so. Who's the favorite Scarf Rain 2 camp? This is actually really good. I could get- I could seriously get Marksman right here. There's a bunch of non-moving targets. And there's a bunch of slow-moving targets, like this one. Here. That was very- very unfortunate. And now it's healing to full. Great. I just had like a streak of nine or something and now it's gone. Hold on, I might actually get marksman here. I know I lost my streak, but 
I can get it back. It's already partially back. Hold on. Snipe it. That thing's just like a recoverable target, right? And I have all the time I need. Now wait. And it's far away, so no other effects are gonna get it scared and hiding. Okay. I don't like this. Great, I missed one. Because of stupid fire. It's fine. I'm not even gonna make the thumbnail of a character this time. It's gonna be of the marksman icon. Oh, great. The marksman icon, the MM88 or whatever. Okay, you know what? I'm done. This was great, but I'm getting way too risky with my shots. Are you kidding me? Take this. I don't know if I even have four. I didn't even think that was that item. But whatever. Hey, could you not? Actually, you're on free kill, so why not? I guess. Hey, did this just waddle all the way over here? Like the other side of the map? I mean, good job if so, but you are dead now. Is it not? Oh no, it was way over there. Oh, no, it wasn't. What am I even talking about? Yeah, no, that wasn't a very long walk. That better have counted. I know I said I'd stop, but... I really want marksmen. No. Just kill it normally. Oh, those don't have weak spots. That's interesting. <sighs> okay. Oh, hey, Monster Log. Alpha Contract. Makes sense. I've killed so many of them. Don't trust that. Huh? Where is it? Alright. I'm starting to get really nervous. If I mess up again, I'm done. Okay, I need to calm down. I can feel my heart racing every time I aim. Except for that. Because it's an alpha construct. It's easy to snipe. Come on, I have to be close. Just give me a few more enemies. Maybe the director is out of stuff. Stay alive, 30. Have I not done that before? That's upsetting. But I'll take it. <gasps> oh, I got it. That was a terrible idea, but I did it. That's fine. Fall. Foolish mortal. I hear alpha construct noises. Let's just fall down. Bar. Honestly, I'll just... I don't care about War Banner. I don't know which items I'm going to get rid of, but I feel like just getting a bunch of crowbars. Oh, one shot the boss. Ooh, gasoline. That sucks. I think there'll be gasoline again. Focus Crystal! Hey! No, I think I want more. Hey, can you not? Got it. Back off. Now I want a few more. I don't know if I have the achievement for going with seven. I don't, and but now I do. I now have eleven. Can you back off, man? Not even paying attention to me, but just please. Get away. Okay, here we go. 
I'm very upset. Although I did do nine, uh, well, closer to eight and a half thousand damage. All right, let's go. Grandparent, as I presumed. Oh, great. We suck. No. Oh, I thought this was the burning radius thing. Are there not any weak spots? Hands? Well, now I'm just doing normal damage. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. I need to run. I hate running, but I need to. I really don't like grandparent. It's always been the worst battle for me. Because of this attack. But I can get outside of it now. Look at that. I'm not dead. Whoa, hey, hey, no, no, no. No more extra radius for you. Go. Back, foul beast. Alright, there we go. Papu feather, I'll take it. And now, we're going right into the next stage, and I don't think I have any way to just get to the... Was that 19,000 damage? Well, I'm sure people who know what I'm talking about know what I mean. I have no cheese, if you will. That's like 9,000 damage on a normal shot. I think the final boss is gonna die. Then again, we'll see what happens. I really don't want to spoil it because I don't think I don't think I've talked about how the fight actually goes all that much, and I want to keep it not too spoilery, just in case if there are new players watching. All right, let's get healed up and see if we can actually make it here finally. See, I'm getting better at the game. Go. Hey, can you not kill me? I literally just... I literally just used the teleporter to get... Everyone, welcome to commencement. The moon of Petrichor 5. No, I've never really taken in... What the hell is that? I've never really taken in, but this place is very beautiful. I wish you could run while looking backwards. The rotational camera. Hey, what's that? Why is it blowing blue? I guess that just happens here. Well... Let's get moving. The enemy already spawned. That's unfortunate. So, this is the last stage of the game that I'm going to be visiting in this run. Whether I... I was going to say win or die, but I think I'm going to win based on that. Hold on. It did it not reach? I definitely hit it. I could see not- oh, there's a thing there. Yeah, sucks. So, let's do this. Honestly, like, look at that. You can literally see the planet. Skyboxes have always interested me. I and mean, obviously not all of these are skyboxes. I'm sure most of these bigger rocks are kind of just decoration out there, but like physical decoration, not skybox, I mean. But skyboxes and just like generally like really far away environments have always been interesting to me. I assume that's a pretty commonly shared feeling. Just like look at that. Okay. 
You know what? I'm turning this up. Yeah. Just a little bit, but... I mean, the music for this game is just too good to not turn it up. You know? Alright, so we have some enemies here, but I can literally one-shot them. Which is kind of unfortunate, honestly, because I really feel like the impact of the difficulty is kind of lessened. Although, then again, I didn't one-shot this one because it got damage from the AoE. So, just so everyone knows, we're just going to be doing some of these pillars. They have different effects. This one, uh, I think, is normal. It just takes a little bit longer than the rest. I mean, hey, this is going to be great. You know, it's really... Sometimes it's really difficult to appreciate, um scenery in games until you record it, which is a really weird thing. Which I just realized. You know, like, I always run through this part without any second thought, but like, this is genuinely a beautiful and very, very weird part of the game. It's weird in the best way, though, you know? It's weird in the, like, I want to see what this is all about. All the time. You know? I'm pretty much just rambling, but, you know, I mean, this is, honestly, this is beautiful. I want to see all of this stuff all the time. So, let's see, no, no, a couple of pillars here which I can check out, no, no, well is five opals better than one interstellar desk plant? No, I don't think so. Honestly, I don't even know if it's five. It might be just a couple. Let's do this. Okay, I forgot about this one. It just repels you. The further you are, the weaker the repel is. And obviously, outside its radius, it doesn't repel you at all. Can you not? What is this? What is this one? Perfected? Is this perfected? The one elite type? I've never seen a perfected enemy before, actually. It's really interesting to me. Luckily, even though it does repel you, actually it seems like it only repels you majorly on the ground, but the lucky thing is that it seems like uh, it charges way faster, you know? so you don't have to worry about being thrown around too much. And Hold on. Okay, you know what? We should. Ooh, K. Okay, okay. Whoa. Wow. Hold on. No. Anything but that. Like, actually, anything but that. That's maybe the worst thing you could have offered me. My M1 is not the best. It's not bad. But it's definitely not preferred over my M2, which is just. Crazy nice to have. You know, it's like the whole hype around the character. This is just bad. I don't know. I don't know why I said just bad. This is bad. I'm saying because I feel like I'm gonna die. Ow. Yeah. Let's just move over here. I think there can be pools here or whatever. I don't know what they're called. Trade items. Let me look around. Only have one more pillar to charge. I might go for a different one. Although there might not. No, there are a couple. What's that? Oh, it's a. Oh, um. 
This game is just so beautiful. Let's go, let's go to that pillar. Because that one's going to be different. And I want to showcase as many as I can. Fortunately, it doesn't seem like there's any here that I can showcase, but... That's fine. Wow! Annoying. Alright. I really like that they have these floating rocks. Because I know that it's probably mainly for decoration. But it does let you jump around which is super nice. Though sometimes it's a little bit anxiety inducing. Or this happens. Oh great. Yeah, I lost all kit wash. And I didn't even get teleported up there. I went out of my way to take a nice little scenic route. And then I lose an item. Oh great. It's perfected. Where's the stupid pillar? I plan on ignoring this enemy. Okay, there we go. Now where's the pillar? What? It can be up here? I never- I didn't even know this was back here. I didn't even know you could come back here. I'll take it. So what does this one do? So far it just seems like it's faster. Oh, yeah, the radius gets smaller. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. I can huddle up right next to this thing. Does it? Yeah, it does decharge. Okay. I shouldn't do that anymore. Oh, and also, we're going to be getting that um, area log. So, <laughs> it might break the immersion a little bit, unfortunately, but... Okay, we're going to 100%, Okay, It's very nice to appreciate the game, but... you guys leave, but, you know, I do need to get unlocked as much as I can. Come on, please. Just get out. Okay. Wow, they keep dying in here. You die over there. Thank you. And over there. I can sit here, wait for that to go, then charge this. Just shoot around to stop them from getting close to me. Okay. That's four out of four pillars. Find a way to release the rescue ship. Well, I mean, these are beaming. I think every- Ooh. Nah, no, no, no. Alright, I think we know what I gotta do. Step on. I really hate to do this, but yeah, I gotta do version. Second. He's seeing what this is. <gasps> what the? I mean, I had to go here anyway, but I would have liked to not just fall randomly. That's fine. Maybe I did something, some input that made it happen. I didn't mean to. Oh, it's not here. Why is it not here? Is it here? I could see it being here instead. Have I gotten to this before? I don't think I have. I don't think I've gone to commencement before. Whatever. We're gonna focus on beating this game. I believe in us. Right? No, 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 no. We All right, let's go. Am I? No, I'm good. I'm on it. I don't I wasn't before. We're in here. We can't leave now. <sighs> Look at that. Whoa, what? Okay, I if you go closer, that'll happen. I didn't think that happened if you just shot. By the way, that didn't do enough damage. I'm sure everyone can tell. I should have kept Gubo. Gubo would have been so much healthier. Gubo's just 
Amazing. Wait, you can do that? Wait, you can execute the final boss with ice? I'm gonna give you frostbite. No, nope, let me down. <gasps> yes! Really trying to step up my game here. <gasps> okay. That wasn't as much damage as I thought it'd be. But I might actually just execute. I don't know what happens if you do. But we'll see. Alright. So it doesn't just end the fight. Because there are, you know, as you can clearly tell, ah, multiple phases. And I'd rather not skip all of them, considering I'm making a video that's supposed to be new player friendly. It's a little bit nerve wracking, but I didn't think that'd be the case, so. I can still one-shot these. That's really good. Okay, maybe not every time. Okay, great. Boom. Gotta love it. Hey, ow. You guys suck. this would be a lot easier. It's really not. And you can tell by the fact that I'm saying it's not a lot easier. Or I thought it'd be a lot easier. Okay, come on. Shoot down and kill those stupid exploders. I hate them. It's fine. Hit him with the shuriken. I'll take it. Okay, so he just summons enemies all the time. I must have forgotten about that. I thought it was just a few exploders at the beginning. Alright. A lot of people die in this attack, but I've specifically practiced this <laughs> attack several times in the past. <gasps> this is bad. This is really bad. This is really bad. I could die. Fungus. Fungus. I don't usually try to rely on you, but I need you. Or if I can kill that, I can get Interstellar Death Plant. Come on. I'm getting really desperate here. Oh, I hate these enemies. <gasps> no! I died to the final boss. Are you kidding me? You guys aren't even going to be able to see the ending. You guys are going to have to wait till, I don't know, maybe next video. Next, not next video, next video on Roar 2. Okay, right, let's, let's check out some of the items that we got. That's upsetting, but that's alright. This is going to be a very long video. So we have... Tougher times. Paul's goat hoof. Oddly shaped opal. Just pause if you guys want to read all this stuff. Personal shield generator. Gore's tomb. Stun grenade. 
Hunter's Harpoon, Shuriken, Rose Buckler, Red Whip, and Interstellar Death Plan, of course. Also, just saying, it's called Shuriken. There's clearly multiple. There's two as an icon, Shurikens, and you can literally hold three. Just, just saying. We got Void Scent Flame. This thing looks cool. Oh, hey, it has an eye? That's, that's really cool, actually. I like that now. I didn't know it had an eye. Volcanic Egg. That was probably from last episode. Gubo Jr. You gotta love the Gubo. Milky Chrysalis. Supermassive Leech. Uh, gross. Executive card. Oh, and the encrusted key. I didn't see that at first. We got actually quite a few monster logs over the last two episodes. I think last time we got Lemurian and Blind Vermin. I only no, that's last time, not this time, because it's dead. I don't I don't I don't think we got it this time. I was gonna say definitely, but I just don't think so. Alpha Construct, which we definitely did get today. Come on. Can't see anything, but it's glowy. And we have Gup, the most adorable thing ever, except for the tinier versions. Um, how do I shift around in this? I don't know how to move around. You can probably only do that with controller. Anyway, with challenges. Uh. Oh yeah, we do have Macho, which we would have gotten it if not, so. Oh, it's just multi. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright. Well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was pretty fun for me to make personally, because we actually almost beat the game. And, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, please like and subscribe. And, well, now that <laughs> brass contraptions are dying a lot, please ring the bell as well. Because, you know, with all that, you're just going to see more of my content. So if you like it, you'll get more of what you like. And, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video, and I'm not sure we have either Spore or um, just something random that I want to do just on a whim. We'll see which one, though. Alright, see you guys next time. Goodbye.